Hello guys, this is gonna be an extremely quick video on how to make a Pong game on Scratch. It's very easy and simple and I'll be trying to show how to make it as fast as possible. So get yourself a paddle, get yourself a ball, and just make your backdrop anything, but make a well, pool of lava in the bottom. So I'm just gonna put a red square or whatever you can call it, a rectangle in the bottom and then well, let's get started with the code of the paddle which is very simple forever it just moves in well our mouse's x position so it's not gonna change y position so it's gonna just gonna move by our mouse's x position so just put it to mouse x and I'll make it uh, move to your mouse's x position for the boss code, it's also very simple. Just make it point. Uh, at start, you can make it point like 45 degrees or minus 60. And then forever, it moves 10 steps and it turns. Well, it doesn't turn. You can just make if on edge on, if on edge bounce. So you just bounces when it reaches an edge. Right now, nothing happens when it, the ball touches the paddle or the lava. So let's make the code for that. So if touching paddle, let's just move our, let's just reflect or bounce our ball. So all you need to do is turn 180 degrees any direction and I'll we'll make our game but all that's left to do is make it so that when it hits the lava we lose the game so let's do if touching uh let's do color red because our lava is red so if touching color red then it's gonna well end the game i'm gonna broadcast that so let's do a message one just put your message whatever name you want and then when that happens when we receive message one we stop all and then the backdrop changes so let's get our game over backdrop it's gonna be just game over with large font let's do that and i think that'll be it for the game let's just change our backdrop the backdrop two and in the start we're gonna set our backdrop to backdrop one and that'll be our game let's start let's check it out so it, it reflects it bounces and let's let it go into lava and it shows the game over and it, we can't play the game anymore that's perfect i hope you enjoyed the video uh, I'll be making a part 2 on this, which is an advanced ping pong game where you hit bricks, and when you hit all the bricks, you win the game. So please stay tuned for that, and I'll see you in the next video.